Hello, it's me, Sarah. Welcome back to Soul Creative. I'm here to share a mermaid uh, ordered planner with you. I took the course by Mrs. Coggs to create these, and I just thought it was, it was, first off, it was a really nice course to take. Uh, I learned a lot from uh, Mrs. Coggs, so... Thank you for providing that for us, uh, Elizabeth. And, yeah, so I'll just jump right in here. I made a little tassel, and you just take all the different trims I thought that would coordinate with a mermaid. There's sorry silk and laces, and there's flower lace and um, yeah so and then I put a big kind of a bigger looking seashell on that charm right there and then on the front cover I made a little pocket here and I just did some stamping and with some sh seashells and then there's a little shell button and a bead and then it's hanging off this really pretty feathery trim. And that just hangs out of there. And then I just put a cluster up here with some sorry silk and uh, some trim and lace and some fibers and a button. And then some trim up at the top. Here's the side view. I have lots of little things hanging out the sides. And then when you go inside, it says uh, this is hanging from one of these swivel clasps. I'd take it off, but my fingers, I have a hard time opening and shutting those. So anywho, inside here I have a little booklet with a tassel and there's an image from Mrs. Coggs and it's just different papers. So that's inside here and that's held on with a paper clip, the little tassel. And then it says Mer People. That's another uh, flashcards that you get from Mrs. Coggs when you take the course. And little postcards as well. And those just slide in here. And then this is another image from Mrs. Coggs as well. It's just held on there with that clip. All the images in here are from Mrs. Coggs, and I just put these two on there, and these two are tuck spots, so let me see. I guess I'll just take one of these out. So there's a little tuck spot here, and then there's a tuck spot here. Plus there's a pocket here. This has a little seahorse on it, and it can flip around. And it has some seed beads and a little bead on there. And in January, all the tabs have buttons on them. You flip it over, I have some fibers underneath here. Layered up the pictures again. Uh, this one is in a tuck spot, but that one is. It has uh, a couple of flashcards in there. And this one says fishtail. With this little pocket underneath here. And then here's one of the bigger images of a mermaid on the beach. Did some stamping or uh, stenciling fibers on the paper clips. Another image says merman. And then I did add some of these word quotes. These ones are from Calico Collage. 
And then I used some Tim Holtz stamps as well. And these are just on uh, index cards. There's a pocket here. It says, beach hair, don't care. I just thought it looked cute with that image right there. And this is February. And then scales, not the pocket. Seize the day. And then this is a little pocket here as well. March. And then there's different uh, fabric tabs along the way too. I use these beautiful sari silks. And those ones, they came from Boho Day Dreams. She's on YouTube and she now does have an Etsy store. Not positive you can get them on there yet, but maybe sometime you can. There's a pocket up there as well. And these images I printed on sticky paper. So. There's a couple of those. Another index card. Tim Holt stamp. And definitions. His life is better at the beach. Another image here. Isn't that beautiful? I like it is. And then here is, I just put these on there. It's like a trim that I had. And I just cut it to make it look like I put the picture on with them. And then this is just a little tag that I added a piece of paper to the back. So you could journal on that. It has a little Tim Holtz paper clip. And then I just put some sorry silk little pieces that I had left over. Some on the for the tabs as well. This has a little turtle hanging from it. Another image up here, love the ocean. Another pocket. And another beautiful image, and another flash card, fibers hanging from the paper clips, just put a little tag in there, stamp the back of it, it says waves, and then there's a pocket, it has a couple, it has a picture in there, and then another uh, flash card. It says catching the rays and making waves. And then this has, uh, I had some trim that had seashells at the end of them. So I just put that on with this little charm of a mermaid. And then this back here, it says beach life. I laid some netting back behind there. And then it says beach life. And then there's another Tim Holtz stamp. And here's another picture. Just put some appliques on there. And then I got a couple talk spots there. Another Tim Holtz stamp. Some more of the fibers. Here's a little pocket with a larger tag in it. It says mermaid kisses and starfish wishes. And I had the starfishes right there. And that just gets tucked in this pocket. And then I have starfish and then the stamp of the starfish. It says, buy the seashore. Put this really pretty applique on the side. Put these photos at the top.
Friends are like seashells. We clucked along the way. I love that stamp. And then, may your joys be as deep as the ocean. Cluck seashells, seahorse. And then shells. Over here, there's a couple more flashcards. The sea calls to me. And it's a picture of a mermaid and a fish. And I had this stamp that had the bottom of a mermaid. And then this image. And then this is also a little pocket at the top. And I just put the sorry silk and then that on the side for a tab. Back here it says the beach is my happy place. That's a beautiful image right there. And then there's a seashell, and then it says that stamp again, uh, mermaid kisses and starfish wishes. And then mermaids as the flashcard. And this image, and then this one. This is December. And on the back, I have that is the trim on the side, and then this card right here. And then I have just little pieces I had left over, so I put some trim on them. And then this little tag. And it says the beach is the beach calls to me. And then the rest of the papers. Just stenciled on these. That's the image on the back. And then I had a mermaid paper clip. And then I put this trim on the end with the seashells and the tassel. And then the back has a notebook here that's in the back pocket. I stamped the back there. And then it has. This clipped on, this is the mermaids, and then there's another stamp, and then it just has different paper throughout it. And then I just clip these together, down here at the bottom, so it didn't interfere with the picture. And then it goes inside here. And then I've added a pen. This is a uh, Z-Grip Flight pen. It's a zebra pen. And it's probably one of my favorite. It, it writes thicker. It's not a fine point. But I write big. And I love a thicker, uh, a thicker pen. I do like the original zebra pens too. I just find myself liking thicker bulb pens. So that's included in there. And then that's this one. So let me know what you guys think and please like, share, comment, subscribe and I will be back with some more. I have uh, uh, several planners that I've made. I just didn't do videos. They are in my Etsy shop but I didn't do videos on Well I did do videos on them but they aren't the greatest quality so uh, I will be releasing those videos randomly here th throughout the next month or so. I was going to wait until it was closer to spring, you know, summer to release them because they are um, more of a spring, summer feel to them. But 
I'll gradually release the videos here every so often. So be on the lookout for that. And I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Uh, I love reading all your comments. If I don't get to them right away, uh, please, um, I will get to them as soon as I can. And uh, th welcome to all my new subscribers. Thank you so much for joining me. And I will see you in the next video. See you when I see ya. Later.